Congratulations, Pete. Thanks. So tell me about that um, that course today and how you approached that. Oh, I mean, it was seven k, eight and a half minutes. It's always tight, you know. I think uh, last year it was about 15 guys in the top 10 seconds. It's going to be the same this year. It's always nice to be on top of such small margins, so I'm uh, pretty happy. So you know, you you were uh, last 10 to go, if I remember correctly. And you know, Jeremy was sitting in the hot seat for a long time. So did he tell you anything about the course? Was there anything that you needed to know? Oh, uh, well, I knew it from last year. Mm -hmm. I knew that it was important to try and carry my speed out of the corners. I don't know if I did that that well, but you know, I was just trying to keep on top of the gear, spin a really high cadence like I do on the track. So I wasn't in the big gears, but I was uh, had a good good rhythm, and yeah, I mean, it came out well for for me and also for all the team. So it's going to be an exciting next couple of days. It, it will be. I guess the difference with the track is you've got that big start to begin mm -hmm. with, but then you have to hold on, whereas a uh, course like today there was a few accelerations out of the corners. Uh, I haven't really raced for a month so I was sort of pretty un unsure of where I was at. Wow. I didn't really know if I was going good, if I was going shit, but <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm pleased I'm, I'm up there. So, so were, you, were you just taking a break? Or? Yeah, I mean I, I had a, a little break after Nature Valley. It's been a long season, you know, because yeah. I raced the track over the summer. Oh. Been going full blast. Uh, you know, we finished third at the World Champs this year in Denmark. We got the Commonwealth Games in October. It's a long season. A very long season. Is this your first NRC win? Yes, it, it is. is. It is, isn't it? Yeah. So. I've been uh, up there, but I've never actually managed to snag one. So. So how feel? Oh, it's good. And it's yeah. one with a big paycheck. Well, it's always nice to uh, <laughs> contribute to the team's uh, kitties. So. All right. So, uh, Jeremy, how about you jump in here and we'll talk strategy now? A quick one. With, with, Peter, with, with, with Peter, with Peter, so strategy, you know, it's a tight one. You've got a lot of guys under nine minutes. It's very tight on the GC. A lot of bonus seconds in this race. So I know, it's a bit unfortunate, isn't it? I thought I'd be sewn up already, but unfortunately, that's not the way it goes around here. So, uh, so what's the plan for you guys? What do you think? Well, Pete's a very good sprinter, so I hope, hopefully we can get him, get him, get him to... Uh, Get some of those bonus seconds yeah. and win a stage. I'm sure he's got it in his legs. So. <laughs> yeah, I mean, the other thing is obviously there's a lot of guys in the team that are up there. Yeah. Yeah. There's guys faster than me in the team, so. I think we're stacked it pretty well. So. so. You've got the, the two brothers, the yep. Maniacs, and you've got Frank up there, you got Patrick Bevan, he's a very good sprinter, and he's going well. And We've got Kyle Lansley, he's very so, good pretty, well, so. pretty confident. And Dan Holloway. And Dan Holloway, yes. He had a very good time. What well, are you doing here? Uh, sprinter. Oh, I'm, I'm joking. All work's done. So, uh, pretty confident going into... Well, I mean, like I said, <laughs> it's got the most money in any race in America. Every single ride is here and every single ride is going good. Yeah. So we've got our work cut out for us. All right. Thanks. Yeah. Thanks, guys. And it's just starting to rain. Good timing. Thanks, guys.